Hello and welcome back to the craft box. My name is Brent and today we are doing the level 78 fire pit quest. I taught you the Ifrit spell some time ago and now I feel you might benefit from having an Ifrit to serve as a pet. Oh, don't worry. I've mastered the art of creating one. It won't be nearly as much trouble as the original Ifrit was. I need you to go to the Cave of Black Glass in Zafaria's Savannah and collect an obsidian bubble. It should serve as an egg. Next, take the obsidian bubble to the Chamber of Fire in Krakatopia. Find the sun-shaped flame basin. The egg goes in it. That flame should create a spark within the obsidian bubble. Bring it back to me and I'll see about the rest. Right, this is going to be interesting. So, um, as you can see, we're in um, Avalon at the moment. But, um, yeah, we quest this character on stream. So, if you don't follow me on Twitch, you should. Um, and you should also go check out my second channel because all of the past streams are there as well. So, in case you missed any, which is great. Um, let's head to uh zafaria in just a second uh, and that was not the button that was not the button okay sure thing it was not the button interesting thing there where if you're in a menu you can't actually click the the x button good job king's Isle. always good um and the savannah not too far away not too far away just over here um this could be interesting i'm assuming fire that is my assumption here that is my assumption. Um, actually, no, she's myth. That's very interesting. Very, very interesting there. She has Earthquake and Medusa, and um, her natural attack does death damage. So that makes complete sense. Where is she? She is over by this one, Darkbane Village. Lovely, jovely. And she will be over this way somewhere. I think she's in that cave there, is my guess. That is my guess. Let's not get pulled by these guys. Not particularly wanting to be pulled today. That is a lot of mistwood. Just all in a row. That's lovely. You love to see it. Oh, look. I was right. She is in this cave. Ha ha. Lovely. She has 7,840 health. Trespass? This black glass is mine. You will not take any from me, nor will you leave here alive. Okie dokie then. Let's go. Let's do this. Shouldn't be too difficult. Balance minion. Not too bad. Um, but yeah, as I was saying, 7,840 health, yep, just checking, because the wiki is sometimes a bit wrong because of the new update to health changes. Um, we're just gonna faint, gonna faint, rank 11 boss, um, not too worried, the biggest thing that she can do is Medusa and Earthquake, those are slightly worrying, slightly worrying, Authorus obviously is the old, the new Authorus, um, yeah, so it's not, not too bad. Not too bad. She has a resist of 80% myth and a boost of 35 to storm and death. So those are the stats on this man's. This man's. In case you wanted to fight him on any other character, I don't think you can. Um, she's not repeatable. Um, and she's only fought by fire wizards. So I don't know why they decided to make her myth, but I'm not going to complain because it makes it easier for me. I don't have to bring prisms, so really I shouldn't be complaining. <laughs> really shouldn't be complaining. What is this? Probably a blade? Okie dokie. This is a shield. Please don't be a shield. It... Okay, good. Good. If it was a fire shield, I would have been slightly mad. Slightly mad. Just ever so slightly. I think we're going to blade again into a dragon. Um, actually, not a dragon. We might... Mm, we're probably going to hit next. Especially if she doesn't hit now. We're definitely going to be hitting next with a meteor, no matter what. No matter what, because I ain't wanting that Earthquake. Earthquake is just nah. It's not something that I want, ever. So we're not going to be doing that. We're just going to be hitting. We could do another blade, but hey, we'll save it for the next Meteor. Because Meteor go boom, as we find out on stream. Meteor go boom. Very big boom. Crit, lovely. Lovely jovely. Nice. And she didn't even block. Well, that's good. She's nearly dead. Just one more Meteor, and she will be gone. Which is fantastic. Okay, it wasn't even an earthquake. What was I worried about? Nothing. I mean, you just see them with six pips and you're like, uh-oh, gotta hit. Don't want your blades gone. <laughs> because earthquake make blade go. Very sad. Very, very sad. But hey, that did actually quite a bit of damage. Um, 
slightly surprising. Yeah, we do need a blade for this. We're not that powerful, especially without a crit, which we can't guarantee because we only have like 28 or something percent crit chance. So we're not the best, but hey, we're getting there. We're, we're doing well in Avalon so far. I'm actually quite surprised about that. Zafaria, I have to say, really nice now. If you haven't seen any of these Zafaria videos, I don't know how many are going to be up by the time this video goes up now because I don't know how far in advance this is I'm recording this. Um, <laughs> but um, you should because Zafaria is actually fun now. And that's coming from me. I don't usually say that about Zafaria. Zafaria, big bad. But not anymore. Not anymore. Right, we need to go to the Chamber of Fire, which is in Crocotopia. Um, and then we need to talk to Dahlia, and that's it. A very quick quest for lots of XP, so we'll happily take that all day. Crocotopia, Chamber of Fire. Let's go. I wonder how far this is going to be um, away in the Chamber of Fire, because it's quite a big area. I don't exactly want to walk too far, because this is the Pyramid of the Sun. And Chamber of Fire is off the Pyramid of Sun. I think it's over this side here, I believe, from memory. From memory, if my Crocotopian memory is correct. I think it is. Am I correct? I am correct. Wow. Look at me go. Look at me go. I'm just so smart. So smart. All of the smarticle particles. We're just going to get rid of these tutorial tips. Don't need them. I don't care that I have max gold. Really don't, Zeke. I am allowed max gold. There's nothing that can stop me. Apparently, it's marked wrong on the map. So, that's a good thing. That is fantastic. I love it when the map is wrong. Um, or at least that's what it says on the wiki. So that's what I'm going off of. That is what I'm going off of. And I think it is in the wrong place because it says it's all the way over there. That's something that they might want to fix. Just saying. Just a suggestion. They may not. But hey, it is. And this bubble you here. You place the obsidian bubble in the flame. It heats up quickly. Soon you see a spark shining from inside. Nice. Let's get this parchment. And then head back to Dahlia. And that is the quest over. Really simple. Nice and simple. Easy peasy. Not too hard. It's a quest we love. Simple quests that give lots and lots and lots of XP for no reason. Other than just because. Because everyone needs that XP. We're currently level 78, obviously. Um, you know, we we making our way. we making our way. Hopefully we will be level 140 by the time the next world comes out. Um, that is after Caramel, so... 140 from caramel because i'm assuming it'll be 10 levels i'm assuming it may not be but most likely will be um so yeah that's the assumption here excellent let me say this enchantment upon it professor of thalmea whispers a charm over the obsidian bubble it glows brighter then begins to shake here you go your very own ifrit pet it should hatch in a moment or two nice lovely it did hatch look at that let's um let's check it out because might as well might as well we have some time where is it there it is baby ifrit it gives a um ifrit card which is the old one vengeful ifrit um lots of damage minus 90 so fun 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 looks pretty dope not gonna lie looks pretty cool it, actually one of the best looking pets let's go show outside where it's a bit less fiery everywhere um no offense but just gives us a clearer picture. Let's take off the mount. The mount. Look at him. Look at him. I really like this pet. This pet is cool. Nobody uses this pet, but it looks so cool. Holy moly. Holy moly. I love it. Anyway, that is all for today. Let me know what your thoughts on my new friend Centurion Max are. Um, and otherwise, leave a like and subscribe. If you're already subscribed, press the wee little bell so you know exactly when I post another video. And remember to craft outside the box.